Here's a way you can use five chords to dress up your soloing. So let's say I'm playing over slow dancing in a burning room. This song really has three chords in the first part there. C sharp minor, A, and E. So a very common place to use five chords is at the end of a phrase leading back to the beginning of a phrase. So the main phrasing of these chords ends on that E major, right? And then we're going back to a C sharp minor. So if I'm playing over the E major, let's say I want a more creative way to get back to C sharp minor, as opposed to just... One thing I can do is add in a quick G sharp seven chord before the C sharp minor chord. Instead of just continuing to play over E until the C sharp minor comes, I'm gonna play notes that are included in a G sharp seven. So there I'm just playing the arpeggio of a G sharp 7 right before I get back to the C sharp minor 7.